Hey guys, what's up? I know the other day I um, put on um, on the Facebook uh, Facebook Merch University channel that um, I had a tip I wanted to share, and uh, it's a way to generate ideas and stuff. And um, I'm I'm just gonna jump into it really, and it's it's really simple. Um, is when you come up with an idea or you come up with a niche, and you're searching it and you're trying to find ideas. I have found that this method, man, it produces lots of ideas for shirts, for text phrases, for anything, for anything that you want to do, for any niche that you want to come across. And it has worked out great for me in just uh, coming up with, you know, easy to find list and, you know, finding, you know, finding out what um, other people are into and just like digging deeper, you know, besides just using Amazon, but actually trying to find like, you know, um, more phrases to um, use for um, your shirts. And so today I'm going to talk about the horse niche just because it's just an example. Um, if you ever if you ever want to find out about something, just type in like, why do people love this niche, you know? And so I just typed in pretty much, why do people love horses, you know? And so you can um, come here and you can find out and you can just read about it, you know, why, why are people, um, you know, in love with horses, you know, and um, you can just kind of read some little stuff here. But um, another place I found out is, is going back to Amazon, but it's going back to the reviews. So you look up the horse niece and you find something for the reviews. This is actually a horse toy. But um, if you start reading the reviews, it's talking about how, like this first one right here is talking about, how this uh, toddler is obsessed with horses, um, you know, so uh, you could come up with something that says, you know, my daughter, my granddaughter uh, is obsessive, obsessed with horses, you know, um, or here's one, our, our granddaughter is crazy for the horses, you know, um, so you can come up with, you know, things like that because uh, a lot of, and what I discovered is that a lot of people are coming on Amazon, and we, everybody knows this, is most of the time we're just buying gifts for others, and that's what I found out. So you're trying to find shirts and make shirts and make designs that um, you know that, I'm sure you know a lot of people in your family or friends who are passionate about sports or animals or um, just different things. Maybe they have a passion for um collecting things whether it be like chickens or um, you know if you're at the thrift store you always see ch people are uh, collect chickens or clowns or uh, bears or anything so what you want to do is you know go through here go through these reviews and um, see what people not only liked about the product but um, they'll start telling you the reason why they love love the product i mean they'll, they'll tell you why they love the niche you know um let me see here oh yeah oh here's one my toddler toddler's over the moon you know yeah that's not the one that sets the horses uh let me see here um yeah like so you can see like they got this for their birthday gift um this is just a toy you know um these are um adorable for my little fans here um, here, let's go to another one. This is a book, actually, um, and it just talks about the different, um, you know, uh, I can sit and admire their beauty and spirit on each page. So you could you could say that you could you could make a shirt that says something about the beauty and the admiration or the spirit of a horse, you know, and you could come up with a shirt like that. Um, and actually, a lot of these people who are buying these things is because they know someone who is create just, you know, a fanatic about this. You know, you could say, um, my, my granddaughter is a fanatic of horses, you know, or my, uh, girl, my, uh, no, or you can say that my girlfriend is, um, a maniac for horse, go is a maniac for horses or, you know, you could type in, uh, synonyms like that in there and, uh, reasons are, you know, my girlfriend is over the moon with, uh, for horses. I mean, there's, there is a, a lot of things that you can get. And what you do is that, um, um, you know, here, look, uh, my horse obsessed, uh, daughters love it, you know? Um, so what you do is you go through here when you find these down, you just, you don't, start making a shirt right you just make the list because i promise you this has over uh, i think 500 
um, reviews, and this is just this is just one rev this is just one part of review of one product on Amazon. But once you start looking further and further of you know of at these reviews, you will find you know a lot of them are about the product, but a lot of them um, will tell you why they love horses. You know, um, there's a reason. There's a reason. There's a reason for them. And so um, I'm just looking through here with you guys to you know so you can find them. You know. Um, gave the here look gave this to my daughter-in-law for Christmas so you could be like uh, you know my daughter-in-law is in love with horses you know I mean you, you come up with your own your own ideas of course anyways but when you do you'll you're using people who already have a passion and you're already using what people are already saying you know so you can figure it out um, great gift for horse fans horse lovers um, you know, there's a lot of keywords in here that you can use to um, help find this. A horse enthusiast. Um, I mean, it goes on and on. You know, my granddaughter loves horses and rides them. So there you go right there. There are a ton of things on here. And I've actually already researched a bunch of these horses and stuff. So, yeah, let me see here. Let's see what else there is. Okay, and then another thing you can do is just type in, like I said, um, why do you love horses? And then you'll, you know, you'll come up with something like this. Um, then here's like some things of why you love horses. I love horses. I can speak to them and they understand me more. I mean, I'm good in conversing with them compared to humans. You know, like there's a t-shirt right there. Um, ho horses. I love horses. I love talking to them, um, you know. Or something you know compared to humans and so because a lot of people you know love focusing on a certain niche and like blocking the outside world out you know or my world is full of horses or you know whatever you want um here's like i think once you become well acquaint acquainted with a horse as a rider um as one takes care of them it's hard not to appreciate the bond you have with them there you go bond there you go um me and my horse have a bond you know just you can come up with ideas like that you know that can sp you know spur something else you know and so um just keep just keep this is like this is the research right here you know you're just you can do this with every niche not just the horse niche you know um horses are the most beautiful am animals on the planet um you work with them in partners um you don't with most other animals you know so um it's talking about the bond too on here so you're de developing a bond i love horses as long as i can remember for me it's because of their beauty and strength you know, I love my, I love all my horses because of their beauty and strength. I mean, see, look, there's just, I mean, we've already come up with probably, you know, a ton of ideas right here. Um, let's see here. Um, that one's talking about a movie. I love horses since I was a little girl. Um, let's see here. I like, I look, I love to watch them socialize and run in the pasture. You know, I owned a horse when I was a teen. So you could say something about, you know, I love to see my horses run in the pasture. You know, you could say something like that. Uh, here's my laid back sport I currently own. Uh, at age 12, still laid back, but spoiled and barn sour from inactivity. I moved to another location. Um, let's see here. There you go. I rode my first horse when I was three. I mean, that you could put something like that, you know, because a lot of these people have a passion that they've been doing it all their lives. So, um, growing up on a working cattle ranch, riding horses just came with the territory. I love riding for different reasons. Um, just become a part of who I am. Uh, it's very therapeutic, riding in the middle of nowhere, hunting cows, or enjoying the day to yourself with your family. Not to mention friendships you can develop, develop with horses. So look, I mean, just those couple of sentences, you can come up with some great um, ideas for shirts and stuff. So, but that's all. That's that's what I want to share with you guys. I know that um, I said I was going to release this the other day, but um, that's what it was. That's what I discovered. That's that's some other research that um, you can do. You know, you don't have to do. You know, it's up to you how you do your research, and um, you're gonna you just use the internet and use what other people 
are passionate about and that's how you find out um about other niches and how to, that's how you dive deep in them because you know you can write i love horses all day you know but once you dig deep and for the reason why people are love horses because think about it you're buying people are going to be buying your shirts to give to other people that that's like the main that's the main thing of what i've come to figure out people are going to buy your shirt so you know it's not i want to buy shirts so you find something that is something that's passionate and then you put that on a shirt and then when someone sees that they go oh that's perfect you know i even was even reading further was where about another niche where it says i'm always looking for funny or humorous um t-shirt designs in this niche and so people are looking for you know funny designs and stuff so i hope you enjoyed this i hope this helps um you know help you in your research um, journey as you're trying to come up with ideas for q4 and just you know just whenever throughout the whole year and so um, i'll talk to you guys later and so, um, you know, if you want, uh, make sure you check out my other research videos that I put on there. And, you know, you can do it. You can get out there. You can write all this down and you can have a whole list and then you can start your research or send it to your designer. And there you go. All right, guys, you have a great day. I'll talk to you later. My dreams are big. My dreams are large. Holding out to God because he's in charge. I hope and if he